how does water get up to the leaves? Here's a plant with leaves and roots, and the water is in the soil, but the leaves need water. Well, they do it this way. Just as you drink through a straw, they do it by suction. So, who sucks? Or putting it more properly, who does the sucking? The answer is the sun. Sunlight makes leaves warm and the leaves lose water. This creates suction in the leaves and this suction pulls the water up. It's pulled up in a row of dead cells, dead tissue called the xylem. This, in a big tree, they move several crates of beer, equivalents of water, to the top of the tree every day. And this is all done by solar energy. They also move nutrients, which are in the soil, up into the leaves. And now, why, when you buy flowers which have been cut, should you, when you go back home, put these flowers underwater, the stems underwater, and cut them through again with sharp scissors? The reason is that when you cut the flowers the first time, this suction pulls the water up and air comes in. And this air does not allow easy movement of water up into the plant again. So you put the flowers under water and you cut them again, two or three centimeters further up the stem. Now it's all water and now they will pull the water up and the leaves will stay firm for the next days. Thank <laughs> you.